place I've made an acai bowl. I always say that wrong. <laughs> like acai? I don't know. Um, for breakfast. But I always make it a little bit too runny because by the time the blender like actually blends it properly, it then gets too runny. But anyway, <laughs> it looks good. So I'm going to eat this and then I need to do my makeup. Okay, so I've just been getting ready and um, I actually feel quite calm this morning. Like usually when I'm about to go out, I get all like stressed out and stuff. But um, so... I'm going to the to the Sophia Webster. I think it's a presentation. I thought it was a show, but I think it's going to be a presentation because it's on for quite a long time. So I'm guessing like people like pop in and pop out and stuff. Um, and I think I'm kind of going via like all with Maybelline. So they're actually sending a car for me to go there in, which is really cool because I get so puffed out when I'm like <laughs> trekking up to the train station now as well. So um, and last time, like the other day when I was trekking up to the train station, I pulled a muscle in my lower belly and it was really stressful. I'll show you guys my outfit before I go as well. I need to finish my hair. Obviously it looks a bit dry. I need to like sort it out. Should be quite a good Monday, like fashion week and then, then oh, the baby's cot's coming later as well. It, they said it'll be delivered between two and 9 p.m. which is so vague. So I've got to be in like all afternoon and evening basically. Here is my outfit. I don't know how good it was gonna look in this mirror, but I'm wearing this uh, kind of cropped black jumper which I got from Nasty Girl actually when I was in um, LA. It has these kind of flare sleeves, it's really hard to show but okay and then I'm wearing these like um, pleated cloths and they're just from Zara and um, no I'm not hiding my bump, <laughs> it's just what I feel like wearing and my jacket is from Zara. I love it and I need to choose what shoes to wear but that's the kind of gist of it. How cool is this? <laughs> we had so many looks at the car and everything during the journey. <laughs> it's massive. Thank you, Maybelline. Okay, I've arrived. Here we are. There's loads of people waiting outside already. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I loved it. Oh, it was really like out there and whimsical and colourful and stuff. So, and there were loads of people in there as well. Um, anyway, getting stared at loads. So, <laughs> I'm gonna go find some food and then head home. I've just seen Char Time and I haven't had bubble tea for ages. So, I'm gonna go to Char Time. I got honeydew milk. No, wait, honeydew pearl milk or something. So good. So our cots arrived quite early, actually, in the time frame. Thank God. I'm so out of breath because I just came up the stairs and I'm rubbish now. So yeah, Jason's gonna build it. I'm gonna try and help if I can. Um, yeah, but it's really exciting for us because the nursery's finally gonna actually look like a nursery. Okay, we've got all the panels out. Uh <laughs>
quarter to six we're just headed into Westfield because we want to because the cot's made thank you but it doesn't come with a mattress so we really want to get a mattress for it um yeah because that's really exciting and we're gonna Prius probably driver. <laughs> get something to eat as well <laughs> Prius drivers are always really bad I wonder if there are any previous look I wonder if there are any previous previous <laughs> Prius drivers that watch the vlogs. Comment sure down below. Are. I bet there are. I don't why know. do you, Why do you have the car? <laughs> like, I don't know. I've never met anyone that actually does does that. Anyway, see you inside. There must be a handle for it. Like a... Yeah, there must be. So we're just looking at car seats. We've got our mattress. It's Tuesday, I forgot to end yesterday off because obviously I got tired as usual. <laughs> but um, we, this morning I've been filming, I filmed two videos and we're just gonna go and get some lunch. I've got tons of makeup on so I kept like piling on the concealer for filming so. But yeah, it doesn't look bad on camera. Anyway, see you inside. So when I left you guys last, um, uh, we went for some lunch. My lunch took ages to come, so I was like super moody. Um, <laughs> and then what else has been going on? Got back home, did lots of kind of adulting, like calling up HMRC, you know, like dealing with tax stuff and uh, what else? Just kind of, I don't know, trying to get a few things done on my to-do list. Really boring stuff. You guys wouldn't, you didn't miss much at all. But tonight, I'm actually... Oh god, I just realised that we're in Westfield. We don't usually like come to Westfield this much. <laughs> but um I come to Westfield because my mum really really wants to see Bridget Jones's baby. Is that what it's called? So um she really wanted someone to go with to see it, so I said let's go and see it on like a really random day. It's like Tuesday evening. <laughs> um but yeah, so I'm gonna meet up with my mum. We're gonna watch the film, then later on I go back home, maybe do a bit of editing, probably crash out. Um but that's Tuesday. There hasn't been that much happening today. Just like a lot of filming. Let's go and meet my mum. <laughs> I don't know how much I'll vlog because it's always, you know, like I always get chat, we get so chatty. And then obviously I'll be in the cinema so I won't be able to film. But um, yeah, I'll let you know how it is. I haven't heard that much about this film so I'm quite intrigued. Today I'm wearing an American apparel dress, Zara coat, and flats. I always forget to get the camera out, but she was so sweet. Hi. The baby's kicking so much today. <laughs> there she is. <laughs> Back home, I've showered. Um, I'm gonna go to bed soon because I'm so tired. Um, but yeah, it was really nice to see my mum. I didn't vlog, obviously, <laughs> that much at all. I don't think I vlogged anything, did I? Um, but I wanted to let you guys know what I thought. It was so bad, it was so bad. Oh my God. Like, I love the original Bridget Jones and I like the second Bridget Jones, <laughs> but this one was just so like awkward. Like, uh, I don't know, like, I feel like I, <laughs> I tweeted that I just didn't like it and so many people are like, oh my God, but I loved it and that's fine. But I just I really don't like when comedy feels really forced and fake like it's not it just wasn't fun it was just such like obvious humor I don't know if you guys know what I mean but I don't know I'm quite a fan of like sarcastic humor or like clever humor <laughs> and it was just such obvious humor like I don't know yeah <laughs> my mum really enjoyed it so that's good because she really wanted to see it and I felt really bad because I wasn't like laughing as much as her and I didn't want her to feel like I was just hating it but um <laughs> yeah it just wasn't real. I know it's a film, but like it wasn't realistic at all. Like with the pregnancy and the birth and stuff. Anyway, I don't want to ruin anything. I just feel like it could have been a bit better. Unless it was super cheesy. Like if you don't like cheese, do not go and see it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Waiting for Jason to come home because he's been at training all evening. Um, so he's probably going to come back and probably just catch up with him and then we'll just go to bed so I'll probably see you guys in the morning. Night! Hey Frank, you look super comfy in the faux fur. <laughs> he looks so com- I'm always jealous of how comfortable they look on this <laughs> faux fur throw. Doing the weekly shop. We've done our shop. 
um, which always feels really good. I love getting home and then like stocking up the whole fridge. Okay, I've got to get putting this away. This is riveting for you guys. Hi boys! Hi boys! It's high five. Good boy. Nicely. <laughs> Royals, high five. Good boy. So you guys didn't miss that much yesterday. I just was doing work in the office. Um, came back home, put my video live. Oh, so there's a, well, you guys have probably seen it by now, but I put up my September favorites video. Then I made spaghetti bolognese for us for dinner. Mm. And then we just went to sleep. So today it's Thursday and it's mine and Jason's third anniversary. So um, we're going out for a really nice lunch. We were gonna go for dinner, but we've had to like move it backwards to lunch. So um, yeah, we're going for like a special lunch together. So, <laughs> why does Frank look so alert? Franklin should be a really nice day. And then later on, I'm doing some cooking and filming and stuff like that. I've got to get my outfit together and then leave. Hey, Riles. Hi. <laughs> Hi. Poor. Poor. Frank. Good <laughs> boy. <laughs> So we're in Hawksmoor, it's so nice in here. And um, we've both got a steak and then <laughs> Jason's got half a lobster. Then we've got some mac and cheese and some fries. All week I feel like I've just been like the vlogs have been so dotted around the day and everything, but just this, I just, I feel like every week is like this, but again, this week has just been nuts. Like, I hardly ever during the day have a minute where I can just, like, sit down and, like, properly catch you up. But there's always something to do, which is great, <laughs> but it just means that, I don't know, I'm just a bit shit at vlogging. <laughs> and um, my mind is all over the place. Like, I really want to start doing some meditation or something at night time or in the morning to kind of calm my brain down because it's always, like, on the go. I had my PO box stuff delivered to the house and um, so I was going through all that stuff because most of the time I don't sit and actually go through it like really mindfully and like look at it properly um, but this time I did so I thought I'd show you guys a few things that I got and I never usually so I don't do this often on my snapchat because I don't know if it comes across as being like braggy I never want to be like like here's all the stuff that I've got like that's I, I don't know, it just to me it just feels wrong to show that and like talk about it, but do write down below if you like, because I like when other people do it, it's just a really personal thing, like would you find it braggy or should I show you what I got in my PO box more often? Anyway, I'm going to show you now just because some of the things look so nice so I thought I'd share it with you guys. I got some pens today just for sketching for N K like design, oh hiccup, designs for spring summer 17. This came in my PO box how random but anyway that's cool to like have a flick through it just gets a bit depressing though when I can't wear any of this stuff because I have a massive bump I mean not the actual clothes in here I can't afford them but you know like you know cheaper alternatives anyway so I have this bag of pixie products oh this is from someone as well it's a little baby kind of a um like dungarees it's by Frankie's threads it's quite bright and i'm not as into like bright stuff but i like the the feathers it's cute um so in here i've got quite a few things i'm really excited i won't go through them all but i'm really excited to try the makeup fixing mist because i i don't know i just love pixie as a brand um i've used this for ages I haven't used it as much while i'm pregnant only like once or twice so yeah there's this dolce & gabbana velvet vetiver which is quite an unusual scent for me. It smells quite masculine almost, so, um, but the packaging is amazing. I love it. And then, <laughs> this is kind of all the stuff together. This Bobbi Brown palette. How cute is that? That's such a good, like, going away palette. So it just has neutral shades and then a lovely blush. I've got this Estee Lauder cream, which looks divine. 
Revitalizing Supreme Cream. There are some Victoria Beckham products, which I'm so excited to try. Like how gorgeous is this packaging? Oh my, this is like a, ra a radiance cream, um, kind of like a primer and a moisturizer in one. How gorgeous and simple is that packaging? Also, someone sent this really cute handmade mobile. I need to un, um, unpick it because I've only just opened it so it's still a bit tangled but how that's so cute thank you um there's a really nice palette in here which I might do a makeup look with and you guys know I rarely get inspired to do makeup looks just because I'm more into like fashion in the last few years but look at that I don't know if you can tell but look at those oh my god like the sparkly colors look so pretty love to do an autumn sparkly look tonight jason's at training he might do a double class which means he might get back at like 10 p.m so while he's out i'm just gonna probably do some work or just like chill with the dogs on the sofa or a bit of both um and tomorrow i've got some uh, meetings tomorrow should be really nice so i'll bring you guys along with me and probably that'll be the last day this week make them look as dainty and beautiful as paul's weekend alter ego and then finally prove the pastry once they've shaped it. Speed in the early kind of in between strengthening this is not. This is so cute. I'm just sitting here like doing some work, and Riley's come and sat next to me. <laughs> oh, don't look away now when I show everyone. Riley, Riley, sitting next to me. Morning, guys. Um, I'm just on my way to a meeting. It's about oh, I need to sneeze. Uh, Twenty-five past nine. Oh my god, I'm so tired. I literally just like rolled out of bed, got ready and and have left. <laughs> but yeah, this should be a nice breakfast. It's um, actually quite near to me, but I haven't been before, so looking forward to checking it out. Today I'm wearing replica jazz club perfume for the first time in ages, and I love it so much. Like I keep trying to smell myself. <laughs> oh my god, how pretty is this opening? Oh my god, I can see a spider web there. I'm gonna have to walk under it. I love that um, having a pregnant belly acts as a deterrent from annoying men. <laughs> the type that would usually like be really harassing. Just don't bother, it's so good. So right now I'm on my way to my second meeting of the day. Second and last. <laughs> um, yeah, so I'm headed up. I'm going to actually the Chilton Firehouse. I've never been there before. So I'm going for like a tea there, which should be really nice. I hope I can get a scope. And it's such a nice day today. It's really sunny, but it's like chilly as well, which I like. Riley. There was the whole train empty and someone has to come and sit right next to me, like the seat right next to me. And it's hot in there. Why? I've got a little bit of time, so I'm gonna pop into Selfridges and have a little look around. into Selfridges I got a foundation that I've been wanting to get for ages and I got some Zoeva brushes and I met some lovely girls in there as well so hi if you came up to me sorry if I'm a little bit out of it when you come up to me because it's so kind of nuts in there it really whacks my head out <laughs> hey guys I'm gonna flip you around because I feel so rough right now I really want to redo my makeup or just take it off and just like relax but I thought I'd show you babies or a bit of baby's nursery because I know that I showed you guys us making the cotton and then I I haven't shown it I don't think I've shown it so it's a bit of a wind up right like just showing you it being done but not the finished outcome so one second so it's not finished yet okay so bear with us um that needs to be moved as well from this room but um yeah it's a bit of a mix right now it's like my stuff is in here still Oh, I'm out of breath. <laughs> so this is the cot. It's from John Lewis. I think it's called the Martha Slay cot, but I might be wrong. I'll link it down below just in case anyone wants to know more. And um, these are just, this isn't like obviously how it's, how it's going to be for when she arrives, but these are just a few things that we've got already. Um, this is from um, the White Company. I love so many of their things. They're so nice. These are just a few of her little booties and shoes and stuff that we've got. Um, and this is a little bear that we got for her. Um, we need to name him. <laughs> and then I really wanted to get this like little elephant rattle because it's so cute. Um, yeah. And then this we fell in love with in um, the Little White Company. It's 
it's a quilt, it's just gorgeous, like hand, it feels handmade quilt. That would just be her <laughs> blanket forever, hopefully. <laughs> so, well, not forever, like when she's 20, but you know what I mean? Isn't it cute? And we wanna obviously put um, like artwork up here. Um, yeah, and just, you know, finish off the room and decorate it still, but that's as far as we have got in the moment. And down there, there's some uh, loads of little baby clothes, but I really want to do a baby clothing haul, so I'll wait till then to show you guys. I've just come downstairs to give Riley some belly rubs. <laughs> no, it's not you for you, Frank. Oh, look, now I'm giving Riley attention, he'll come over. He wants to steal the attention, don't you? <laughs> he loves it. I'll probably sign off here because it's probably been a really long vlog actually. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. Oh, I might, okay. I obviously don't want to promise anything and be annoying, but um, I'm thinking about doing Vlogtober, so um, hello. Oh, he's literally sitting on Riley. Get, get off him. You're so rude. I don't want to promise anything that I can't deliver or that I might not deliver, so. But yeah, but I thought I'd let you guys know that I'm thinking about doing it. Um, if not, I'll just try and carry on doing like weekly vlogs. And um, I hope you guys like them. I just like making them quite kind of real, really. You know? Like obviously I don't make my vlogs too glossy or anything because that's where I kind of put all my effort into my main channel. But yeah, hope you're all well. We might go to the cinema tonight and go and see the girl with all the gifts. But I'm not sure because I've been to the cinema quite a lot recently. <laughs> I will see you guys. I'll see you guys next week, probably, when I'm going to be 28 weeks pregnant, which is crazy. <laughs> um, yeah, thanks for watching. Bye.